I talked in the last video about analysing your meditation, or, or over-analysing it, but in effect any analysis at all would be an over-analysis, because as I said in the last video, we meditate simply to meditate, and then it is done, and it has an effect on our brain, and that has an effect on how we perceive reality, and that changes our lives. Analysis is very often, all too often, simply useless thinking. That kind of useless thinking abounds in our ordinary everyday lives. I was talking to somebody a couple of weeks ago who talked about the behaviour of other people and the effect those people were having on his life. Now, I only got one side of the story, but the point is that an awful lot of what he was saying sound as if it was not so much made up as magnified. That is what we tend to do. First of all, we do make things up. We see ghosts in the shadows that aren't there. We think people might be trying to get at us, and basically those people are simply wandering through life, making it through the day, not without a care in the world, but without a useful thought in their heads. So very often we concoct scenarios about what's going on, when in reality very little is actually going on at all. As this individual's boss has said to him on a number of occasions, he said, you think too much. And it is something that you should always remind yourself about. Thinking too much drags us down a lane where our thoughts kick the living daylights out of us and mug us and steal our own energy. Thinking too much is the stuff in which the ordinary mind revels. And you end up, through thinking too much, by creating a whole cast of characters that actually aren't there. You end up, through thinking too much, by creating a circus in which, sadly, you end up as the clown. Life is about living, not thinking. Life is about doing what I need to do in the here and now to get to where I want to go, not thinking about it, or not thinking about how difficult it might be because there are other people who are trying to stop me. Life is about getting what is best for me out of life, not necessarily what I want out of life, because what I think I want out of life is a product of that useless thought that I've just been talking about. What mindfulness, what purposeful mindfulness, enables us to do, is develop our ability to be present, to focus on the here and now, mindful of where we want to go. And through being present in the here and now, mindful of where we want to go, our thinking ends up taking a back seat. Now that sounds like an ideal day to me.